Meet Zonzon and Hua Hua. These macaque monkeys are more than just a couple of cute faces. They are the first primates cloned using the same method that made Dolly the sheep. The findings were published in this week's journal, Cell. Scientists say it's an important breakthrough considering their close relations to humans. We've been waiting for, for this work uh, a long, long time, um, almost 20 years after Dolly the sheep. And, uh, and I can tell you, um, sometimes the public is not aware of of uh, how much uh, non-human primate research have helped human health. And so this, this would open the door to new therapies. Dolly the sheep was the first mammal to be cloned with DNA taken from an adult. It was announced in 1997. About two dozen mammal species have since been cloned through a similar process. These two were born genetically identical within the last eight months at the Chinese Academy of Sciences in Shanghai. The cloning process begins with a monkey egg and a fetal monkey cell that has been cultured in a lab dish. Researchers remove the nucleus, which contains the DNA, from the egg. The other cell is slipped into the egg, so it replaces the egg's nucleus with its own. The egg then divides and grows into an early embryo, which is implanted in a monkey and grows to term. It took 127 eggs, of which 79 were implanted as embryos, to produce two babies. Uh, so I, I think that they did an incredible amount of, of work uh, there's still things that we can improve for sure, and um, this is going to be one of those seminal papers that we're going to be referring back to for many years to come. Scientist Jose Cibeli at Michigan State University says if the process becomes efficient enough in monkeys, the public could face a big ethical dilemma whether to adapt it for use in humans. Currently, mainstream scientists and ethicists generally oppose trying to make human babies from cloning, citing safety and other concerns. This in a sense, we'll, we'll start the conversation again about whether we want to use cloning as a way of reproduction in the future or not. So far, the baby monkeys are growing normally. The group is expecting to clone more macaque over the coming months. The Chinese researchers say clone monkeys would be useful for medical research. Carrie Antelfinger, Associated Press.